Yes! Yes! Hi guys, Sunday is here, back again for another video on the channel. In this one today then, Sun City take on Barnsley at the Swansea.com Stadium. Of course, it's Easter weekend, so games are coming quick and fast before the end of the season. Swan City then, you know, we're trying to get into the playoffs now, slowly looking up, I guess. You know, we're on 57 points, trying to get in towards those playoff places. Barnsley, 22nd, I believe they're on 29 points there. 8 points off Redden, who are currently in the safe position in 21st, but they do have a game in hand on Red and. Yeah, Barnsley, you know, they've got to win this game. You know, it's looking bleak for them. To be fair, though, a couple of months back, you know, you'd say Barnsley were dead and buried. So they have picked up a little bit of form, but they've just not been consistent enough to get out of those relegation places. They've only won one away game all season in the Championship. I think I was away to Hull. So, yeah, Barnsley away from home, you know, a very, very poor side. But at the end of the day, you know, they should be up for it. Derby were well up for it, and they just narrowly got beat by us. So, yeah, Barnsley, you know, they're going to be up for it today. Fair play to all their fans. We're traveling, maybe it was about 250 to 300 of them, which, you know, let's be fair, one away game all season. Easter weekend, people probably want to go out, spend it with their family, and, you know, some hardcore Barnsley fans are coming down today, so fair play. Um, but, yeah, should be an interesting one anyway. I'll give my score prediction later on in the video. Last time we did play Barnsley, though, we did beat them 2 0. Southern Barnsley always seems to win 2 0 to the Swans over the last couple of years. And for some reason, the last couple of predictions I've done, I've predicted us to draw or lose, and we've won. So I'll probably carry on that theme later. But yeah, against Barnsley in November, there was a little bit of trouble after the game, a few fights between some Barnsley and Swansea fans. I remember there was a Barnsley fan who ran on the pitch as well, trying to give it to the largest Swans fans, which was pretty funny, to be fair, considering the midweek away game. But yeah, let's head down to the Swansea.com stadium. Let's hear some of the uh, boys' score predictions, and let's hear the lineup, and then I'll give my all important score prediction. So the Swans team for today's game against Barnsley, unchanged I believe from last weekend's 2 win, win against Derby County, but I'll go through it anyway. Andy Fisher in goal, back three of Ben Gamango, Kyle Norton, who has recently said new to the is absolutely massive for us, and Joel Abordia. Wing back stars, Christian Hannes, Wolf, not the only Wolf player today. It's actually, I think it's either a Wolf or Wolf feet play for Barnsley, which is quite cool. Uh, in the midfield, NJ Ford carries on his start season in the midfield today, and so is Matt Graves, I believe, making his 200th appearance in the Swans City shirt. The front three them, Jamie Patterson, uh, Michael Lumberfairman and Joel Pro. Barnsley, some decent players them. Coley Woodrow's back in the match today, scored for the first time in a couple of months, coming back from injury. Adebayo's on the bench, he's done alright for Barnsley over the last couple of years, not too sure about this season though. Uh, Morris up front for Barnsley, I remember in the playoffs last year, he was a big, big threat off the bench in the first leg, he definitely deserved a goal, but yeah, Barnsley, don't know too much about their players, I know, I think Helic, one of their main centre-backs, is out injured at the moment, which is a big, big blow for Barnsley, but yeah, score prediction, I'm going to go for a 1-2 Barnsley. I know we're going to lose today, but like I said, I always break this a lot, lose a draw, and then you know what happens. So yeah, I'm just going to carry on the rhythm. Do I actually think we're going to lose 2-1? Who knows? But I'm going to go 2-1 Barnsley, score us the Swans. I'm going to go for uh, probably Joel Pro to score for the Swans for Barnsley. I'm going to go for Corley Woodrow off the bench and Carlton Morris. But we all know, you know, with the Swans, we are more than likely probably going to lose today. But yeah, a point. Don't really matter, but yeah, go go two one Barnsley unfortunately. And also shout out to Alan Reese, the man in Birkin for the game. He's come all the way over from Germany for the game. So yeah, shout out to you, mate. Great commitment. With Taylor, YouTube channel Barnsley and Thomas, you go and check it out. Cracking vlog. Stuff you've missed the game this season of you. No, mate. Today is the final ground to complete the championship, so mental. And I think you've only won one away game this season. Is that right? In the <laughs> yeah, championship? That's the one, mate. <laughs> yeah, what's your prediction today, Ian? Uh I reckon we're gonna get bad today. 3 0 Swans, Obafemi hat trick. Hat trick, Jesus, yeah. not happening, but a lot of lovely optimism, but yeah. YouTube channel of Barnsley on tour. How many subs are you on now? Just shot three and a half K. Yeah, so go and subscribe to if you haven't already. Cheers. Cheers guys. So Curtis, score prediction today, Barnsley at home. Yeah, well Barnsley are gonna be fighting today, aren't they? Yeah. And, and we're on good form. I think it'd be a cracking game today in football. I fancy five goal thriller. Five goals, what's your prediction then? Three two fonts. Score us. Um P Row will get another brace today, I reckon. And I think Patterson's doing another goal. Yeah. And for Barge, we go with Carlton Morris and Amang Bassi, also known as Shirley. Cheers. So Jake Barnsley home today, score prediction. Um, I'm going to be optimistic. Swansea 3, Barnsley 0. Um, Jamie Patterson, Joel Pino, and Matthew Grimes. Nice one. So Luke, Barnsley home today. Can the Swans make a 6 and beat them? Yeah, I think they can. Obviously, Barnsley is struggling. They do have something to really play for. Uh, it is looking 
Big game for Matt Grimes, the captain. Two one for Tears today. And this one's taking a shoot and of course Cal Moe inside the contract midweek. Big, big players want to send the energy to see them still playing this one taking a shoot today. What a beautiful day. Only a few more games to go to the rest of the season. Wish uh, that the stadium could be like this. Quite full today. Beautiful day. Come on in, Swans. Good ball, Christy. Nice layoff on the edge. Shoots. Oh, save already. Oh, what a tackle. Good tackle. Oh, you are having a laugh. Free kick to Barthi in Dana position, followed by Kurt Bengamango. I thought it was a bit of a naughty one to be fair. Free kick. Oh. On side. Chance. Clipped in. Oh, that could be a goal. Oh, good to head up. Barthi really doing well so far in the game, you know. They've Put their mark on the game, creating chances. They could be one nil there. They got another corner, but fair play to them. They are going for it. And they're, they're giving their fans something to sing about. We are far gone, so sort of you know, Barnes and I think uh, Barnes have done really well to be honest. They've sat in, they've pressed as a team, they've created some chess from set pieces, so it's all nil nil. But um, yeah, they're putting in through strong tackles, I think, already on the yellow. But, yeah, nothing to scream out in terms of shots yet for the Swans, but we all know, you know when there's a team like this who you know, defend well, we will get a chance sooner or later. Yeah, nil nil. Of a Femi, gotta get this right, Patterson. Oh. Parsons there, got to be doing a lot better, got to be giving it. It's a nice one touch attack in football, Parsons ruined it. Oh, oh, good opportunity there. Oh, half time, Swansea nil, Barnsley nil. It's not been a great game on the eye. Can't really complain though, you know, as it stands, six unbeaten. But yeah, Barnsley, I think they've set out pretty well to be fair, you know, look dangerous from set pieces. Giving everything for their team, I think Red are winning as well, which means I think they'd be 10 points behind ready with the game and as it stands Barnsley but yeah I think they're gonna have to go for the win they will have to go for the win if they want to survive which could play into our hands of the counter-attack we've already seen it once or twice you know we'll have dangerous for the counter-attack but yeah just not at the level today which you know I don't really mind because we've got nothing to play for but you know another home win would be nice on to the second half come on boys oh big chance goal Wow, what a massive goal for Barnsley. That could change the rest of their season in the short term. What a goal that is. Really, really good counter attack. Question about foul in the middle of the pit, not for me. They deserve it, they've been the better side. At the end of the day, we've got nothing to play for, so, you know, most players focus like there. Fair play, Barnsley. Deserve the lead, they've got the lead, really good finish. And now, uh, Barnsley will use all their game management to try and hold on to this victory. 1 0 down. Oh my god, off the post! Bloody hell, I think I came up one off all the players, off the post! Could have been 2 0 Barnsley. Not good enough. Brilliant. Go on! Go on. Yes! Yes! Get in there! Come on! 1 1. Come on! Wow, what a finish, Lily and Jam. We've seen it so many times this season, off the bench. He can change the game, he's done it. Fair play to Harley as well, so you know, great activity. Bloody super yet again. Switching the ball to Christie. Christie went jam outside the box. Brilliant finish. No chance for the keeper. We've got 25 minutes to go, so we want Barnsley won. Barnsley need the three points, so he would like to win again. So, yeah, it's been an interesting final 25 30 minutes. But, yeah, what a finish, Livy and Jam. And I think managers come on as well. Come on. Oh, how's he missed? How has he missed that? Wow. We've literally only just now got the equaliser and it could be 2 1 down. Defensively, poor, 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 poor there. We are getting away with it. If this was against a team a bit better than Barnsley in terms of their tail position, it could be 3 4 1, but big, big chance of Barnsley missed and that is probably why they're the bottom three. They just can't take their chances. Go on, Norton. How is that a foul? Jesus, these referees, man. Some strange decisions, fair play. Seven to go. 
think there's a goal in this. Yes, go on! Oh, corner, come on! Oh, corner ball. I think it's going to be last action of the game. Come on. I don't think we're going to score, but I'm a jinx, so yeah, it's definitely not going in. Come on then, Matty Grimes. That's the chance. So we finished full time at the Swansea.com stadium. Swan City won, Barnsley won. I think Barnsley will probably be the more disappointed side in this game by not picking up the three points. They had the chances to do it. Uh, Morris had a great chance. How he missed, I'll never know. They also hit the post in the second half. Swans, you know, Encham came off the bench, made a difference, got a fantastic goal. You know, could have had a penalty potentially. You know, I've not really seen a replay of it, but, you know, I'm saying the same things week in, week out. I don't want to blame the ref because, you know, the ref wasn't at fault. I thought, you know, we weren't at the races today. But Paul Staves has six games unbeaten in a row for Martin's men. I guess it's a point closer to sixth place. I know we're not going to get it, but you always want to look up because Sheffield United dropped points. So I think the gap's down to seven now. Yeah, Monday against Red in a way should be a really, really good away day. I've already been to Red this season. We won 3 0 vlogs on the channel. But yeah, sort of away ending that one. So it should be limbs if we score anyway. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the vlog. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you on Monday. Not a great performance on the Swans today, but I'd rather have a point than have zero. So have a good weekend guys and I'll see you on Monday for Ren V Swan City. Enjoy your weekend.